Welcome to Blank Canvas Beauties. I'm Cassie. I'm Tammy. Hold on a second. <clears throat> okay. Hopefully it's going to pick up. Anyways, um, Josie and I did a video and we did a Revel dip system. And Tammy has very short nails and we're just going to show how you can also use it on shorter nails. Now I'm just going to do a little shaping really fast. She has, um, with her extremely short nails, I don't want her catching these corners. So I'm just going to round hers out. Kind of make it a little bit more on the round side. Gives her a little bit less catch. Now, I am not a nail technician. I am just a mom who likes to save money. And one thing that my girls do like is, you know, pretty nails, getting their nails done. We, I know you chew your nails, honey. I don't like getting my nails done. Okay, she's had her nails done like once. One of my life. Well, this would be the second time. My other daughter likes getting her nails done. I hurt. Okay, so I'm going to finish rounding these out, and then we will be right back. Okay, we are back. I've got her all situated and ready to go. I see it. All right, so we are going to start... She is all sanitized clean. Mm. All right, apply a thin layer of number one Pro Base, even using even strokes from the base to the tip. That has a okay, so on. we're going to do my opposite on her. So she's going to have this mostly one. this one. Oh, sorry. And then her accent nail is going to be the um, purple sparkles, mystified, the D132. And then her other ones are going to be the color changing Pandora. So I will go ahead and get these open. It's on. I'm it's on. Okay. Can you scoot your hand back a little bit, please? Tammy. What? I'm trying to get to where it shows my hand. Your hand is fine. <clears throat> Filing them. What I like about this is there is no smell. I mean, literally. Then <laughs> dip it one more time. There we go. If you put the part, the colorful one and the pink one and then the colorful one again. I don't know. Wanna try it? What? Wanna try it? What are you talking about? I mean this pattern for the first time, then that one for the second, and that one for the third. No. Okay. Other hand? I hope so let's do do what? I said, oops, that was too far.
this powder is going to last forever. the activator out Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and put the lid back on the Mystic powder. Mystified, sorry, mystified powder. Put the activator out here. I said I rounded up <clears throat> I rounded out her nails because I know like I've got a couple nails on my hand that I'm a little concerned with because I will probably catch them on everything. I guess if you were just using one color you could do this on like a sheet of paper and then just pour the powder that you're knocking off back into the jar but I haven't even made a dent in these jars yet I'd like to get some of the French tip 
powders. I think that'd be fun to have. with some activator. Did I hit that other one with the activator? I don't think I did. No, just in case. I'm going to hit it with again. Hit this one with the activator. Okay, with that set, I'm going to go ahead and put the lids on my powders. And then I'm going to shape and file, and we will be back. Okay, we are back. We are all filed. We are all cleaned. Rinsed off with water, no soap. Now, um, apply a second coat at number two, the activator. So that's, that's this one right here. Yeah. Right I'll tell you this, I do not like the <clears throat> filing part. Well, if you wouldn't chew your nails. So we're going in here with the activator again. Her nails are really, really short, so I had to be very careful when it came to the filing. And so some of them just aren't as on par as, you know, mine. But it is a whole lot easier filing your own nails than it is filing somebody else's because you're so afraid. <clears throat> you're so afraid you're going to hurt them. <clears throat> But, all in all, they turned out really good. Even for shorties. So yes, my shorties, you can use this system and have really pretty nails and strong. I was tapping them and it almost feels like glass. I drew off layers of my nails, so it's kind of, hmm. Now, it's been 15 seconds for this hand, so I'm going to dry it off with paper towel. And then we're going to put the uh, number three finish gel. The first coat should be applied with using two to three quick brush strokes. Don't worry about getting close to the cuticle area or capping the edges. Can I have the other one, please? Go ahead and wipe this one. Sorry. Um, you're pushing them really hard. I'm sorry. Okay. So, this is number three. Alright. 
Sorry. <laughs> so we're gonna go in here with number three. Ooh, your nails. And I'm just gonna do a quick layer of number three here. <coughs> Quit moving. Sorry. I said, don't worry about getting close to the cuticles or capping the nails. <coughs> And my other daughter, she's 17, and she did her nails on her own, which we'll definitely have pictures of all three of our nails at the end of the video or, you know, put somewhere in the video. Okay, give me the other hand back. All right, 15 seconds. You put a second coat on, and this is going to be your more... capping the ends, making sure you get to the cuticles, just don't flood the cuticles. And this is what's really going to pull them together. What really amazes me is is how quick these dry. I'm usually okay. So this says um, I do have a cuticle oil in my bedroom, which I will be applying to. Why? because it'll help your cuticles become healthy. But I have to wait like one to two minutes before I apply. Yes. I just said one to two minutes. That's it. Not 15 minutes, not 20 minutes, no lamp required or needed. Now my oldest daughter, she did use a gel top coat and a lamp. Um, she didn't get the shine that she was looking for. There we go. Now let that sit. Um, I'm usually a very talkative child, but I'm really tired. So this is mine that I did earlier today. And this is the color changing nail here. And then the others are just a glittery nail. Now Tammy has the opposite of mine. So we just kind of did a different, you know, look. Um, but what did you like about them? Pretty. pretty easy. Yeah. They're pretty easy. Like I said, with the right tools, I mean, six dollars at Dollar General, dollar, Dollar General, dollar, Dollar General. Um, I think I paid like two or three dollars at Sally's for that. But all these colors, I mean, it's just amazing at the color range the mood changing ones which like I said this is the one that we have been using right here for the mood changing I can't wait to get some of the sun changing colors and they're pretty big pots I mean they're not they're not small these are the smaller pots I think these are the half ounce Yep, these are the half ounce. 15 grams, I think is what it says. So, but again, if you're interested, I'll leave a link down below because if you can save money somewhere, why not save it, you know, where you can. So, but uh, thank you for joining us and uh, we hope you have a good evening.